science, the classification of animals. Let's learn about fish. During this video, we will identify lots of different fish. We'll have a talk about some of the characteristics of fish and finally have a mini quiz at the end. First, let's see if you can name some of these fish. Stingray Tuna Blue Tang Shark Puffer Fish Seahorse Piranha Trout Eel Butterfly fish Now let's have a think about some of the characteristics of fish. Fish come in all shapes and sizes. Some are camouflaged and others like to show off their bright colours. One thing all fish have in common is that they live in water, such as ponds, lakes, streams, rivers and oceans. All fish are vertebrates. This means that they have a backbone. Fish are cold-blooded, which means that their body temperature changes along with the temperature of their surroundings. Most fish have scales and fins. They do not have hair or fur. Fish breathe through their gills. Gills are often found on the side of their bodies. Their gills have a very important job of extracting oxygen out of the water. Now it's time for a mini quiz. Question 1 What is the world's largest living fish? The biggest fish on the planet is a whale shark. It can grow up to 12 metres long and can be as heavy as 18.7 tonnes. That's as heavy as a double-decker bus. Wow! Question 2 Fish have no lungs. Instead, they breathe through which part? Fish have gills to breathe in the oxygen contained in water. Question 3 What is the fastest fish in the world? It 
it is the black marlin with a maximum speed of 129 kilometers per hour. Question 4 What is a group of fish all of the same species called? A group of fish of the same species is called a school whereas a group of fish that are a mixed species is called a shoal. Question 5 Do fish have eyelids? Most fish do not have eyelids and that's because they really don't need them. Eyelids help moisten eyes so that they don't dry out. Since fish live in water, dry eyes are not really an issue. I really hope you enjoyed learning all about fish. Let me know if you did by giving this video a thumbs up. And make sure you give yourselves a well done for super learning. Go to Love to learn with Miss Ellis for lots more videos and remember to subscribe. Bye for now.